talk and anticipation for Nicki Minaj's new single Freaky Girl may have sent the rap queen's name to trending status on Twitter over the last few days, but a peek at the platform Monday, August 1st, had people chatting for another reason. A woman claiming to be Minaj's former assistant took to social media to expose the Grammy nominee, alleging everything from sexual promiscuity and payola use to suggesting the rapstress secretly suffers from domestic abuse at the hands of her husband Kenneth Betty. The poster's claims may have been unsubstantiated at the original time of posting, but that didn't stop detractors from having an absolute field day with the negative press. Tired of the hoopla, Nikki took to the web Monday night, August 1st, to put a stop to the madness. Hop inside to see what she said. Don't at me no nonsense cause I won't respond cause I'm not a fan I'm just watching the unfold pic. Twitter. com slash v5 joe 9 v 8 i 94, Brea, at juicebox underscore b August 1st. 2022 almost 50 disparaging posts were made from a page registered to a person named Kate Miller, some of which can be seen in the tweet above. I I'm exposing all files I have from working for her. Along with the voice messages she sent me regarding many different people, she says later. Taking to Instagram Live, Minaj fired back at Miller at those who have believed the messages the mysterious poster has been spewing. Every day I learn that y'all getting dumber and deaf king dumber, she said. The other day I was on Twitter and I saw this whole fanbase, BTCH. While Nikki did not debunk Kate's accusations specifically, she did offer a blanket denial. I am mind blown that people are this effing dumb, she said before later sharing, that people are really believing that I got some bod. Chili. But, it's not even that. It's the tea sounds so effing dumb, and for a person to believe it, you would have to be dumb. It's clearly a kid. As of time reported, the Kate Miller page has been removed. Press play on the video below courtesy of our friends at TSR, to hear more from Nikki about this situation.